All right, hello everybody and welcome back. I'm Cassis Plays, and here we are with the finale, finally, of Who's this Taurus? I'm what's Assassin's Creed Death Black Flag. He's a Templar. Starting right into the mission, too. Men cooking up schemes to use the observatory for ill purposes. For power and control. If you enjoyed the, the video, definitely leave a like and subscribe for more as well. Deadly. Yet leaving no mark. Does that make sense? Like, if there was a drought and people was thirsty, and one man had a large cask of water but gave a sip to none, he'd be a killer with no blood in his hands. Aye, like that. Fair enough. All right. Ah. We're almost there. We are almost there. I went ahead and uh, between the last episode and this one, I went onto the uh, island and traveling around on the ship, upgraded my ship a little bit and defeated the two, two ships that were stopping us from uh, actually getting onto this island. So instead of uh, struggling on video, I decided to just do all that uh, off, off footage. So that way, when I did start this episode, we would be going straight into the actual mission itself. And that's where we're at. Jesus, look at all this. Corpses for miles. They brought every ounce of menace they had. See if we have any. Yeah, right now I'm actually out of ammo. Hopefully we can find some bullets. They are running through here shooting everybody. been a long time coming for this uh this finale this definitely was the longest out of all the uh assassin's creed games i've played so far um i mean it's still nothing compared to the ones that that released today but uh with the time wise at least compared to the last few games that we've been playing this has been the one that has taken me the most amount of time and it's mainly it's really because of the ship combat the ship combat um it's a lot of fun but it really held me back for some missions we ran into a lot of issues with not doing enough damage um or taking too much like even until up until like right now i literally was trying to fight uh the ships or get past them before i even started this video and i was still getting wrecked then um, so then I, I finally decided, you know what, I'm just going to go take down some ships, board them, do whatever I need to do to upgrade it, and then return. And that's exactly what I did. It didn't take me too long, but it definitely, like, if I would have recorded it, it would have been an extra hour <laughs> of footage. Meanwhile, we're, like, exactly on the the last mission. But I didn't want to add all that uh, filler in there. So I decided to just wait and do it off, uh, off stream and off video. If I would have done all of this on stream, it would have taken me probably another two or three hours. So I probably would have had enough content for today to do a stream, but that's okay. Oh God. No! Oh god. And that was the end. 
of Edward Kenway. Literally got disintegrated. Now, does it matter which side we go on to? Oh no, it's right there. Oh, okay. I almost tried jumping the other way. Uh, like straight, not to the right, like this. Oh God. Kill Torres. Place is not happy. Holy screen shake. That's not good. Okay, this part's gonna be fun. No! Oh my god. I don't know if it's just me or like this game in general, but like, holy crap, like the difficulty towards the end of this thing at all the other Assassin's Creed games is like next level. Does this murder fulfill you? 
I'm only seeing a job done, Torres. As you'd have done with me. As we have done, I think. You have no family anymore, no friends, no future. Your losses are far greater than ours. That may be. But killing you rights a far greater wrong than ever I did. You honestly believe that? You would see all of mankind corralled into a neatly furnished prison, safe and sober, yet dulled beyond reason and sapped of all spirit. So I, with everything I've seen and learned in these last years, I do believe it. You wear your convictions well. They suit you. Torres awakened something fierce. Are we safe? With the device returned, I believe so. What do you call this place? Captain Kenway's Folly! It's a wall to sue to kill her. Cat winning. We will seal this place and discard the key. Until another sage appears, this door will remain locked. There were vials when I came here last. Filled with the blood of ancient men, Robert said, but... They're gone now. Then it's up to us to recover them, before the Templars catch wind of this. You could join us in that cause. I will, but... Only after I fix what I mangled back home. It arrived last week. And there we go. Was that sequence 12 complete? May have been. Juno. And for a brief moment, I thought she might occupy this tender body of yours. But something went wrong. And now, she's back out there, adrift. Oh, she was magnificent once. One of a race of beautiful, wonderful creatures. They created your kind. Did you know that? Your people were tools to them. That's all you have ever been. That's all you should ever be. One day soon, I hope. For the world is nearly ready for her return. Wired. Prepared for a second coming. <gasps> Uh-oh. Here they come. Those Templars. Or maybe assassins this time. Idiots. All of them. I envy you. It was her wish that I be here to greet her. It was her experiment that made it possible for my rebirth as one of these things. Ah! Stay down! Get down on your back! Now! She's got a gun! Guide me into the grave, beloved! I am your instrument! Put the gun down! Drop it! Drop your weapon! Clear! Clear! Check his vitals. He's bleeding fast. Check the victim. Are you okay? Can you hear me? Hello? Talk to me. You all right? There you are. Thank God. Ah, oh, you're finally awake. I hope you feel well. You look good. Uh, Can thanks. You stand? Good. Try walking ah, around. at least I still have my tablet. Oh, I'm gonna go anywhere without my tablet, of course. A doctor came by, said there wasn't anything to worry about. 
that the liquid in the syringe was far, far below a lethal dose. I feel terrible about all this. About everything. All our evidence pointed to you, but it was John all along. God, the things we found on his computer. Whatever you need, we'll provide. You've done an amazing job. Speaking of which, our trailer is finished. Would you like to see it? I owe you that much. There we go. I uploaded it to your database. You can watch it here or at your Animus. I think you'll love it. It really captures the, the essence of the era. So, take care. And again, thank you. In a world where pirates rule the, the waves, audio is not coming these through. men will discover that nothing is sacred and everyone is committed to rum. Everyone's Plunder committed to rum. Plunder. And women. Hola, lady. Okay. The audio wasn't playing through. Uh, for whatever reason, my uh, headset, it was playing through my speakers, which is weird. Okay, so they're basically just telling me that they have more missions we could do or hacking we could do. Um, one thing I'm kind of conf confused about is how was that guy, uh, what's his name, Rogers? How is he alive in our time? I don't know if they kind of explain that. Because, like, he died in his time, so I don't know if he was just reborn again or if he survived and then was resurrected or I, I don't know I don't know I kind of need to look some that up to see why or if anybody knows feel free to leave it in the comments too uh, as a refresher for myself or like I'll, I'll probably look it up but if anybody else like wants to know too they can probably find that out great Inagua October 1722 gentlemen how do you find it here it will work for us, but our goal must be to scatter our operations, to live and work among the people we protect, just as Altairi Ben Lahad once counseled. Well, until that time, it's I'll yours you. as you see fit. Edward, Captain Woods Rogers survived his wounds. He has since returned ah. to England, shamed and in great debt, but no less a threat. I will finish that job when I return. You have my word. Well, that's that explains it right there. <laughs> he survived his wounds. Evening, Anne. Edward. I'll be sailing for London in the next few months. I'd be a hopeful man if you were beside me. <laughs> England's the wrong way around the globe for an Irish woman. Will you stay with the assassins? No, I haven't got that kind of conviction in my heart. You? In time, I. When my mind is settled and my blood is cooled. 
Sail ho! Coming into the cove! You're a good man, Edward. And if you learn to keep settled in one place for more than a week, you'll make a fine father too. And yet another Assassin's Creed complete. I've honestly been uh, surprised that I've been able to do each one of these back to back. I don't know. I'm debating about possibly taking a break between this and Rogue, but we'll see. We'll see. Um, I'll have to figure it out in the next few days whether I will be playing or not. I don't know if we can skip this part. I think we just have to sail. So Rogers did survive, and that's how he ends up where he is today, basically. So I'm kind of confused who this girl is. Is this Edward's daughter? Did you always oh. know how to sail a boat? <laughs> the jackdaw is a ship. Jack. Never mind. Not a boat. But did you always know? No. No, I learned after leaving Bristol. After you left Mother? Well, I didn't leave your... I didn't leave without saying goodbye, that is. It was an arrangement, you see, between your mother and me. She said you left her. She said you always talked about sailing a boat and making money in the new world. I did always want to sail a ship. That's true. But not for a lot. To support us take care of her and you not me mud said you didn't know about me she said you worked only once a year and that she never knew where to find you that's all true and i'm sorry for that if i'd known earlier i might have come home i hope that i would have well you were busy that's what i think i was but that wouldn't have mattered. Can I see your boat? Boat? I see no boat here. Do you? I mean ship, obviously. I don't see the difference anyway. Ah, it's a very simple one, Jenny. A ship can carry a boat, but a boat cannot carry a ship. Why then, everything's a ship. Large and small, but for my toy boat, the one I take into the bath with me. <laughs> well, 
That's a clever way of seeing it. Is it hard to talk about Caroline, Jenny? About your mother? Mm, no. She passed some years ago. I miss her, but it's all right. <laughs> Was she in pain? I don't know. I don't think so. She was very happy for quite some time. Then, not so happy. I didn't see her much after that. Then, she was gone. I... I'm sorry. I'm sorry I wasn't there for you. It's all right. You're here now. And we're on an adventure. Uh, only a little one, I hope. I can't handle too many more surprises. You think we'll see a whale? Yes, there's a very good chance. Mm. And what about pirates? Will I see pirates? No. Not much chance of that, I think. Oh, that's rather sad. I should have liked to have seen one. <laughs> Tell you what, Jenny. As soon as these winds die a little, I'll let you steer the jackdaw. One little trick of the helm before sundown. Yay! <laughs> Oh no, I think this is playing through my speakers again. And not through the headset. Yeah, it is. Ugh, I don't know why it does this. <clears throat> Miss Jennifer Kenway, may I introduce myself? Jennifer Scott, if you please. I'm sorry, I... I, uh, My daughter was raised by her mother, Caroline, until she passed away some years ago. Jenny prefers to use her surname to mine. Ah. Oh, looks like it's still picking it up. Ignorance. Nice. I will. She may not. Father, help me. This little rascal, however, is a Kenway. What's wrong, Haven? I can't see the stage. Up we go. How's that? Fine, but won't your arms tire? Hey, I'm not so old as that. But if they do, then we shall quit this posh gig and go and meet your mother for some chocolate and whites. How's that sound? Yes, please. Okay, hush now. And that's Little Haytham, the father of Connor. Saw that one coming. <laughs> nice achievement. There it is. It's cool how the, yeah, it's technically like one of his first, uh, or probably not one of his first kills, but one of his kills locations. It's where you see Haytham in. Assassin's Creed 4. I wonder what happened to uh, Haytham's father, um, like Edward. I wonder if they ever explain it or if there's any mentions in Assassin's Creed 3 of him being a pirate. I mean, obviously, they didn't make the game yet, but I don't know. Um, but yeah, that's going to be it for this uh, series playthrough for Assassin's Creed 4 black flag if you did enjoy it definitely leave a like on the video let me know uh hopefully in a little bit here we might get uh rogue started and uh we'll most likely do that live on stream as i have been doing for the rest of the assassin's creed games so for now thank you as always and hopefully i'll see you guys in the next one peace